Hey guys, welcome back. I know I haven't posted in a while, but I just have things going on in my personal life and I'm busy with school, so sorry. <laughs> I just try to post on here whenever I can. I do post more frequently on my TikTok though, so if you want to check that out, feel free to and maybe hit a follow. Now, for today's video, since I haven't done it in such a long time, and it's Halloween season, I will be telling a scary story. I'm going to be telling you my second drip drip story. Be prepared folks, there is some description of gore at the end. Now don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you like this content, and let's get into the story. I seem to have lost the light. Hold on here. Ooh, never mind. <laughs> Found it. <laughs> Alright, let's get into the story. There was once a young man named Jack, who had recently moved out and got his own place. When he got his own place, he also decided to get a dog, because he was never allowed one as a child. One day, Jack came home from work, and as usual, he was greeted by his dog. After greeting his dog with pats, he went and sat down on the couch with his dog to watch TV. When he turned on the TV, the news channel came on, because he had been watching news that morning for the weather. Right as he was about to switch the channel, though, the headline caught his eye. It read that a psychopath had escaped the nearby asylum, and that everyone should lock the doors and not answer for anyone. So Jack did, did as instructed and locked the door. That night, when Jack was going to bed, as usual, he let his hand down beside his bed for his dog to lick his hand. He felt the tongue graze his fingers, and contently, Jack went to sleep. Drip, drip, drip. Jack was awakened in the middle of the night by a dripping sound coming from downstairs. So he got up from his bed and went to inspect the noise. It was the kitchen faucet. So Jack went under the sink and tightened the faucet, which stopped the dripping. With the noise subdued, he went up back he went back upstairs and went to bed. Again, letting his hand down beside his bed for his dog to lick it before falling back asleep. Drip, drip, drip. Again, he was awakened by a dripping sound. It was again coming from downstairs, only a little closer. It was the downstairs bathroom. So again, mm -hmm. he tightened the faucet and the dripping stopped. Content, Jack went back upstairs, laid back down in bed, let his hand down for his dog to lick it, and went back to sleep. Drip, drip, drip. Again, there was a dripping sound, except it was very close. It was coming from the bathroom that he had in his bedroom. Getting a little bit more annoyed and eerie, he got up to inspect. It wasn't coming from the faucet this time. It was coming from the shower. So Jack walked over to the shower, reached out his hand, pulled back the curtain to find his dog hanging by its intestines, blood dripping from its body. Drip, drip, drip. And on the wall behind it, Written in blood were the words, Humans can lick hands too. And there you go, folks. That's my other drip drip story. I know you guys didn't ask for it, but I hope you liked it. Leave a like on the video if you did, and comment down below if you want to see more videos like this more often. Also, don't forget to subscribe. It costs nothing, and it just makes me feel good if you like my content. Well, I hope you guys have a happy Halloween, stay safe out there, and see you guys in the next one. Love you guys, bye! Please leave a like on the video, and maybe subscribe. Thank you, bye, have a good day.